So you sure you don't want to get this one right here? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. And that is why I don't want to get that. The one that got the big crack on it. What you think, Tim? I want to get this one. Yeah, look, I guess it's y'all. Why am I asking mama? This is not mama's room. This is the boy's room. <laughs> Excited everything that mama said. Rewind. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You want to actually wind up? Yep, yeah, I should have done that on the video. <laughs> All right, boy. So what y'all think? Y'all, y'all look around. Tell me which bitch y'all like. IG Farms, all about God. We have a fun day planned today for you all. And uh, we're actually finna hop in the truck, hook up to the trailer, and head on a journey because uh, we're finna go bed shopping today. And uh, we're gonna, our goal today is to get our get a king size bed for our room and get two, two bunk beds, either one bunk bed and a twin size bed, or just get two sets of bunk beds. Where, where our goal is to get two sets of bunk beds to just have an extra bed just in case the boys, cousin, Carter wanna come over and spend the night or something like that. And so that's the goal for today, and uh, we're finna load up. Megan is inside of Emma with the boys, getting them ready. And uh, she did farm chores this morning, and she told me that uh, one of the pigs' waters in the boar, boar uh, corral is uh, is leaking. So I gotta go in there and get that water fixed in there because, uh, you know, it's not safe <laughs> for anybody to go in with the boars and work with them. So I'm gonna go in and work with the boars for a minute and get their water fixed up. And then I have to get this trailer here unloaded because we, we need to uh, hook up to the trailer so that we can you know, have the room for our beds and mattresses and all that good stuff. <laughs> we should have a trailer load full of mattresses and bed frames by the time we get back this evening. But I need to get this trailer unloaded and it's just some some flooring material that I ripped up uh, from the boys' rooms and the homeschool room when uh, we did flooring, when we did carpet. And uh, we're also, our goal is to also, uh, we probably stop by Home Depot on the way back and pick up the flooring, the LVP flooring, the laminate uh, vinyl, uh, the vinyl plank flooring. So that we can put throughout the house in the kitchen uh living room area and hallway and the bathrooms and so that's the goal for today like i said to get the beds get our bed situation figured out so we can go ahead and start sleeping inside of emma and to also pick up our flooring so that i can start doing the flooring it shouldn't take me nothing about two or three days to do flooring and uh i'm gonna take this stuff that we have on this trailer here and put it on another trailer we're just <laughs> switching switching junk from trailer to trailer but our goal is after we get all of our junk all the stuff that we're gonna rip out is to rent one of those uh you know portable dumpster things and they just come and dump it here and then we can put all the stuff that we want to dump into there instead of having to make multiple trips to the to the city dump so yeah that's that's the plan for today and i'm finna get ready to get the truck warmed up get hooked up to the trailer and then get all this stuff unloaded off the trailer and by that time megan and the boys should be done and i also have to go in here and fix this this water in the hog pen so let me get those things done and then we're gonna load up and head and go go bed shopping <laughs> y'all just join us for this journey today it's IG farms it's all about god
got it perfectly lined up. Surprise? Nope. Good. Just trying to make sure. Basically good. You, know, you get the signal, don't you? Uh, one thing, you know you don't know if they see it or not. Right, exactly. One thing I know, I'm just not going to let you run into something. Yeah. I'll let you stop an inch before you run into it. You know, that's uh, one of my things. I try to get the trailer as close to like obstacles as I can. Mm -hmm. It's like a challenge for me. Yeah, that's fine. I knew you, you know, you're su such a good, you know trailer backer up or driver everything you probably had it but i would be like sick if i let you uh run into something oh yeah <laughs> as long as it's not the van everything else is just falling apart. you can run into it oh uh, yeah you're right and to why you let me run into the van why you let did me you see, did you see how i opened the farm gates that day when you were taking too long oh yeah you I bumped just, it i just bump into it with the truck yeah bump into it with the trailer just fly over yeah. you gotta bump it just right so you don't bind it if you bump it quick it just like swing open yeah uh, yeah Cause I bumped it before and it just kind of bent, bind it. <laughs> yeah, I'm. I'm gonna try not to let you run anything into anything if I can help it. Ready to get these beds? I'm ready. Listen, I'm glad we're showing this part. You know, like this is the real part of the. Uh, process. Yes, because people will think we just popped up right. and uh, went to the furniture store and bought some beds. Exactly. It's like, now nah, we got to unload the stuff from the previous uh, <laughs> uh, renovation exactly. uh, project. Yeah, I told them that we're going to rent a dumpster for all this stuff. Yeah, we we're are. Just piling it up, piling it up. Yeah. Just moving it from trailer to trailer. <laughs> yeah, I would like to have a, a grapple on the front of my tractor by the end. Oh, so okay. Grab the stuff and dump it in there. That would be nice. Goals. Goals, goals, goals. We like to say that. And you know what? Most of the time, thank you, Jesus, we end up accomplishing them. That's most of them I thought it was. Because I've been having the boys move. It's just been the boys' job. Yeah. Like, move all you time. haven't been moving it, huh? It's like this. It's like, it's like <laughs> you want me to get them? Need some help? Nah, because it's too far to show it. Oh, yeah. Now, you might have to put the camera down. And oh, yeah. Might have to set the camera up and help you, huh? Yeah, all right. I'll do that. I'm going to give Tim a helping hand with this pile and we'll see if we can work it down more quickly that way.
there's a time for us I know we could have it all If you stay for a while I will show you I can make the call All right, y'all. Got the trailer unloaded. And uh, we're gonna go down. We got the pig water filling up down here while we're unloading the trailer. So it's probably overflowing by now. <laughs> so we're gonna go down, and turn the pig water off because we're filling up a 55 gallon barrel. Because, like I told you all, they messed up one of the nipples. And uh, we'll get that turned off, get the boys, and we're gonna get loaded up and head on to. Go uh, bedroom bed shopping. That's right. <laughs> so y'all just continue to follow us on this journey. So we've got all the, you know, things that shouldn't have been on the trailer. <laughs> all the like, junk, like, yeah. what do you call it? <laughs> we got all the junk unloaded, right? And now we have all the people loaded. And we're ready to go bed shopping. Yay! Let's do this. Inside bed, bed. Let's, Let's do, do it. it. And flooring. Uh, yeah, we're we'll gonna pick up Lauren too. Okay, you got the bunk beds back here. Okay, cool. I got you. Let's go back out here and look at the king side beds real quick, boys, and we'll come back back here. Yes, sir. All right, mama, it's, it's on you. Your, 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 your time to shine. Look at this one. Let's see. Oh, yeah, it is nice. Mm -hmm. Something to put it together. Yeah, it's kind of like a, it's white, but it's kind of like a washed white or something. I think they call this a sleigh bed. Mm-hmm. Now, the thing is, we got to look at the little frame part to make sure that it's solid. Yeah. So, you do, 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 you, do your thing. It's on you. So, are these like, a, like the manufactured wood or is this real wood? You don't know. <laughs> I got you. Can we look? We want to just see kind of like what the railing looks like underneath. Just kind of want to make sure it's sturdy enough. Back up, boys. Back up. Okay, so they so got it. It's wood just the wood, on wood with, with the, some metal. Metal, yeah. So it looks it's pretty sturdy, though. Yeah, it feels pretty sturdy. Mm -hmm. yeah. Watch out, boys. Back up. So how much is this for just the bed? Five Okay. All right, let's look around, see what else. Okay. Yeah. Look out. But Excuse us. Right away. Okay. Oh, so talk nice. us through, Mama, what you're looking for and oh. what, what, what your research okay. has shown you. What so I'm looking this? for something. First of all, it's sturdy. You mm -hmm. know, I don't want something that's just made of MDF oh, yeah. or something like that. Um, and I second, I want something that looks kind of rustic. Mm -hmm. So for like a farm cottage style feel. So that's pretty much it. Those are my two main categories. Mm -hmm. I got you. Cool. And today we're just looking for the actual bed frame and the mattress. We're going we're gonna to do dresses and stuff later on because uh, we want to kind of add a little bit of flavor. You know, find, find some stuff in some different, you know, places, antique type stores. So we have one option here. This this washed looking white. I think that'll look good. See anything else you like? I'm looking now on the. So th th this yeah. is too put together for you, right? This is too yeah, like. It's yeah. It's nice, but it's just not our style, style. for the um, feel that we're looking for. Looking for that country cottage cabin exactly. feel. Exactly. Yeah. Now this one is a little bit more uh, dressed up. Mm -hmm. I think it will still, you know, go in. Work. It's got our colors, the gray mm -hmm. and the um, white. So how much is, is this frame here? You got to check, okay. But um, I, I think I like this. Mm -hmm. What about the one behind you? <laughs> That's something. You need, need a castle to put that bed in. <laughs> <laughs> That's something. It's nice though. Both of these are nice. This yeah. one's a little bit more. It's like it should have like the curtains them. that come down the side. You yeah. could probably do that with the frame. Pr Princess Megan. Yes, that's <laughs> a lot. 
It's some, huh? It's something. But look at the uh, the top. They got like this. Uh, oh, yeah. That costs a lot. It does. I'm sure. How much is the bed? That they got the tag back. back. Damn, once you see it. Oh, that's not the tag. It's just a, it does say marble though. So yeah, this looks very expensive. Mm -hmm. Let's see what they got I down this way. Talking about the topping in with like two or three thousand dollars, that would probably be like that canopy. Two thousand. Because yeah. he did say a canopy bed. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. I guess. Around three thousand. See what they got up in here. Oh yeah, that's now that's some. Let's get this one. You talking about the label? Oh yeah. Take it back to the 1970s. Yeah, this guy nice, so I like this guy. Yeah, I like the end. Mm -hmm. yeah, that is. I about to see that. that nah, I don't get on it. What y'all think, boys? Y'all think that'll work in him? I want the black. Man. Black? <laughs> Whoa, blue. 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 Looks like they have some smaller babies. Okay. So these are queen. I like those. Uh, the gray. Oh, yeah. They, I actually like this one right here. Right this in front nice of us. nice, too. Yeah, that, that's like perfect. I don't know if that has wow. any king, but. Nope. Look at it. You see it, you see it wiggling? It's got the rustic feel. The see, other one's it. much more sturdy. Look at the I headboard when I it. shake it. Yep, yeah. so it looks nice, but don't touch it. Stop. You break your back. Now maybe we could put in like the. Now that looks good. Dresser. Now that looks yeah. good. That looks uh -huh. nice. Or I wonder how much that dresser costs. I don't know. Cause it is, it is nice. Mm, I like it. I, I like wonder, how they did. Yeah, yeah, we had to look at the color of it though to see what it matched with the bed. Yeah, that I is a nice dresser. It still got that wash effect. Mm -hmm. Don't have to match perfect. Yeah. But, yeah, yeah that, that, that's kind of what we're looking for. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Y'all let me know, subscribers, family, what y'all think about this dresser. Maybe we can pair this dresser up with the other bed. Yeah. It is a little bit more rusty. Yeah. It needs a couple of uh, chips in it. Like, uh, you, you can tell it's, it's not, you know, real wood. Yeah, it's not. But it needs to be chipped up, you know, like. Maybe we can. Oh, looking. Maybe we take that and we can do something like mm -hmm. that. Mm hmm. Yeah. A reclaim type thing. See, they got some tables and things in here. Let's see what we're looking at on tables. I don't see anything. Just looking at it, glancing at it real quick. This is about the closest thing, but that's that's not really it. We want it to kind of look like a real wood, like, like I say, almost like a big picnic table mm -hmm. with benches on the side and maybe two chairs at the end. Yeah, they got, they got a lot of flavor in here. All right, let's go back to the to the bed we're looking at. Looks like we're down to two options, right? Mm -hmm. It was saying how much was it? This one. This one, yeah. How much is this one? Okay, like you calling somebody now. Sounds pretty sturdy. Like you can't just shake that one like yeah, you. Yeah, the other one. Shaking the other one. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, see, it's uh, it will probably go in. Probably would, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Shake and see if it passes the shake test. Oh yeah, it ain't going nowhere. Yeah, you shake it. All right. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, solid. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I like this bed. Yeah. That's the one thing that we don't want right there, is that happening. <laughs> but that's what happens sometimes with these, uh, you know, the the manufactured wood. Mm -hmm. I don't know that. That kind of, that kind of feels like real wood. That feels like real wood. I don't think that's manufactured, but the thing is, what about down here? Yeah. But it feels solid though. Where, where, is there a label, a sticker, or something? It, it mm -hmm. probably says on the sticker. Because I would like to know before we buy it. Mm -hmm. So that one's five ninety nine. Yeah, that this one we like, and then this other one, how much did you, did you figure out how much this one was down here? Yeah, it's pretty much between those two options. For this king, babe. It does have a big old nice little headboard. You barely even need pillows for that headboard. It's nice. Mm -hmm. And one option we did talk about was building our own like headboard. Just mm -hmm. get the rails and then make our own headboard just on the wall. But you know, right now we just need to to buy it all together. Yeah. But the prices are not right, <laughs> you know, and the, the quality is not right. You know, we can we can do what we need to do. What y'all think, boys? Yeah! Right. Y'all think we can all fit in this bed on a movie night? Yeah. On fr Friday night, pizza night. Yeah. We can all pile up in the bed and watch uh watch movies. A Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park. Or Hunger Games. TV. 
without that little time. Yeah. What's that last movie we watched? The Christian movie, uh, A Wing, a wing of Prayer. A pray on yeah. a wing and a mm -hmm. prayer. We've uh, burnt out Pure Flix. <laughs> we've we've watched, watched every, every movie. Pure Flix movie there is. Although they may have some new ones yeah, now. Yeah, we had to get the app back. Yeah, mm -hmm. since we last had it. So that's what we'll do. We'll get the app and we'll have a little fun family movie night. Yeah. We'll get With our TV and mm -hmm. everything set up. And right. that a little bit. Hi, damn, I'm sweating. But yeah, y'all, we're gonna uh, we're gonna figure out how much this bed here costs. Which it's, bed? What would you? Yeah, use? for y'all, let us know in the comments which one of y'all think. Or do y'all think we should go somewhere else? Do you think we should get get one of these two? Let us know what y'all think. And uh, y'all have a minute to figure it out before the end. Mm -hmm. And so yeah, it's between this one here and that oh, one man. over yep. there. And they both seem pretty pretty good quality. Mm -hmm. And so uh, he's looking up the price for this bed here. This one over here is a uh, five ninety nine. That one there. And uh, he's looking up the price for this one here to see. This one seems like it's probably going to be more expensive. It's in the more expensive section. <laughs> so uh, we'll see. But uh, we'll just pick y'all up and we start going back and looking at the boys, uh, and looking at the bunk beds in the back. All right, y'all. So we decided to get this bed. We're going to expect it a little further because this is actually the last one. <laughs> so we'll be actually getting this bed from the showroom floor. So we're going to look at it closely, make sure it's good, and then we'll load it up. I can come in and add some. How's it going? Yeah, I can come in and add some thicker uh, slats. There's not a whole lot of slats on <laughs> yeah, there. Either. It sounds like it needs to be a, a slat in between. Yeah. And that's not metal, is it? That looks like another little MDF of wood. That's wood. Fake yeah. piece. I guess, I guess once it kind of sits down, mm -hmm. those are supposed to like bear the load. Yeah. But I could come in and, you know, I'm, I'm trying to buy a bed and, and fix, fix it. I can make this better. <laughs> we just can't buy, huh? It's like I, I just framed up, you know, a, a firewood floor and it was like, you know. Yeah, more stuff than, than that. that. <laughs> I, I can go on my wood pile. I can get some, get some pieces of wood and make that better. But that's what it looks like, though. It looks like a... Like I say, it's a bed, so, you know, it's kind of like... What do you think? Uh, I have to look at it a little more closely, but uh, yeah, I, I guess this have I, I don't really have any uh, frame Made of reference. Right. <laughs> I, I know what you would make or what mm -hmm. I would want it to look like, but then to go back to like, okay, can we buy a different quality bed or something like that? It's, so. in, it's in the price range, mm -hmm. so I think at least. Yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, It's kind of like it's either this one or go somewhere else. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to figure it all out and we'll pick y'all back up and give y'all an update. All right, y'all, I think we're pretty locked in on going with this one. If we, if we do get a bed from here, we're going to go with this one that we've been looking at. And so now we're looking to try to see if a bunk bed with that bed falls into our budget and kind of get an idea. And so they have a wide range of bunk beds back here. So let's turn around and look at them. All right, mama, what you think? Yeah, I kind of like these uh, metal frames, bunk beds. I like it because they have like the gun metal. Oh type yeah, color. yeah, and that's our color. Yep, right. gun metal. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. Yeah. So you sure you don't want to get this one right here? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. And that is why I don't want to get that. The one that got the big crack on it. Mm -hmm. What you think, Tim? I want to get this one. Yeah, look, I guess it's y'all. Why am I asking Mama? <laughs> this is not Mama's room. This is the boy's room. <laughs> X out everything that Mama said. Rewind. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You want to actually run, run, wind it? Yeah, I should have did that on the video. <laughs> All right, boy. So what y'all think? Y'all, y'all look around. Tell me which bed y'all like. Because the thing is, are we gonna get two bunk beds, or are we gonna get one bunk bed and a twin bed? What's a twin bed? It'll just be the size of the bunk bed, but just a, a bottom piece. That's probably what we need to do for now. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Let's see what they have. All they need is a frame. Y'all ain't even know. <laughs> Just like the railing for the mattress. Oh, yeah. 
So you're leaning towards this metal one right here? Yes. That right metal. Right. It, it, it don't have a big uh, rise up on the rail, so somebody's going to fall out of it eventually. Well, Tim Jr. can uh, slip on the bed pretty good without falling out so far. I got you. But, so you're really not on, on, you're not, not feeling the wood ones? I'm not. Okay. Not these, at least. I got you. Yeah. So we're looking for something sturdy. Yeah. Durable for the boys. Mm -hmm. Cool. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yes, I can't take my shoes off. Just sit on right on the edge because you got dirty shoes on. Just sit right there. I don't think I'm Just turn around and sit down. Is that sitting down though? No. You crazy. What does it feel like now? Nope. You like that one? I like how they're short because of the bump beds we had at the other house that were so tall. Yeah, these are perfect height. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They're nice. Yeah. Yeah, sit on it, boys. Let me see what y'all think. I'm going in the top bunk. They can't do D. They do two D beds. Yeah, that, that's kind of that was the plan to do two bunk beds. It'll be room. What you think? That's the one that mama kind of is leaning towards. Mm -hmm. Okay, because if you know Noah and Titus in our old house, we just had where well, we had one bunk bed and a twin bed, but we got rid of the twin bed, and then Noah and Titus just slept in the bottom one because they they could both fit, you know, like yeah. long ways. Yeah, but we I moved on from that. that, you know, the little tiler bed. Yeah. But yeah, so. And that'll probably take up too much room. I actually yeah. like it better with the uh, yeah, I like give more playing room. room. Uh, the single little. Bunk bed like that, mm -hmm. you know. Cause uh, two of those would fit. Mm -hmm. this is so I guess we gotta figure out how much this one is. Yeah, yeah that's a twin bed. Mm -hmm. oh, All right, y'all. So it looks like we're leaning towards this bunk bed here. Yep. Looks if like we, it. Looks yep. like they only had one. Go ahead. Yeah. So if we get it from here, we're gonna get this one. So we'll, we'll decide if we're gonna go ahead and get this bed. If they have two of them, check what the price is, and then the other bed. So. I like this one better. Sounds good. You like Titus? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I do like the ladder. Yeah. Mm -hmm. two, I like two, of those, get over. two of those look nice in y'all's room. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. We're going to put the camera down and figure out the price and see if we can negotiate a little bit. And then we'll pick y'all up in a minute. Yay! All right, you want to give them the news? <laughs> Yeah, so we decided to get two of these bunk beds with the mattresses. They actually come with the mattresses, so that's great, amazing. I think it's a great deal we got on these bunk beds. So we're gonna get two, and we're going to get that bed frame, uh, the one that we've been looking at the whole time. Mm -hmm. yeah. And But we're going to a special store to get a mattress because we think we can yeah. get one that will really help Tim's back. So um, it's actually the lady we met when we bought the camper mattress. And so we're gonna go back to her store she said and, she's gonna take care of us. We told yes. her that once we got our house, once we moved out of the camper, we'll yes. be back to get us a nice mattress. And we're gonna hold to our word. <laughs> That's right, yeah. So we're gonna get loaded up with these bunk beds. We're actually getting two of them. So we'll have a spare bed for visitors to <laughs> sleep in. <laughs> Grandma, we got, we got a spare bed for you. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bunk bed. Oh yeah, it'll be Carter. Carter, you can come spend the night That's when you get right. ready, buddy. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna get these bunk beds loaded up, get that bed frame loaded up, and then we'll be headed to the other mattress place to try to get us a king size mattress for our bed. So y'all just stay tuned, fun times. Yeah! <laughs> by the Mississippi River. But anyway, we're gonna get loaded up and uh, we're having fun.
Oh yeah, for real. These are super nice. Yeah, these are really good quality. I think the boys are gonna. <laughs> yes, most definitely. <laughs> Put the sheets over the plastic. <laughs> Why they crinkling? You know, you know, I know. Back in the day, come on, when you went to the auntie's house, they had the plastic on the couch, and it was just like crinkle, crinkle, crinkle. The mat, yes. But we, listen, we understand that now, don't we? All right, y'all, we got loaded up with the boys' mattresses and beds and our bed frame. And we're going to get our mattress from um, here, this place, boxed up. And we're just headed in to pick out our mattress now. Hello, thank you. I was hoping y'all had her in here. Hey, you know what? We just got one of them fixed. And one oh, that's so good. We're pretty much in like a warehouse. That's right. Yay! Hey, boys. Hey, How are you guys? How y'all doing? Y'all been working six now? Man, what about you, Daisy? Seven. Seven? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Are you eight? Yeah. Nine? Ten? Four. Eleven? Oh, four. <laughs> oh, four. Four. My bad. My bad. Y'all haven't had any water with you. Uh, you know, I don't know. You don't. Okay. Look, we might have one because I just emptied out three of them when, when we place. got here. Was that in Jackson or was that? It was, a um, what's the name of the place? River City Furniture. Gotcha. Yeah. Is, that, is the air not working? It was kind of like a warehouse type. Yeah. You know, yeah. No air. Uh, I've heard good things about it for the most part. So. Yeah, they have some nice stuff like yes. that. Just, All right. So we don't have everything that they have, but we have mattresses. That's, good. That's why we came here. Yeah, listen, we promised you that we would come back to you. I, I remember. I, you remember I, I told her, I said, you guys have the farm and the little boys and the YouTube mm -hmm. She remembered us. I yeah. Did I not? You did. did. You get a chance to check out the YouTube channel? I, I, when y'all first came mm -hmm. in, I remember looking like that day okay, or yeah. something. But I honestly, yeah, after that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, well, you're going to be on there now. Okay, so. good deal. Good deal. Yes, we'll check it out. We will check it out. Say, box drop, Vicksburg at the Mall. Y'all can cheer. Okay. We'll give you one. We usually have more, but uh, we've kind of emptied it out this week. Thank so gotta, you. I got to get some more. Y'all going to bring a bunch of them But yeah, we try to have like all mattresses, all sizes. We try to have some for everybody's budget. We've got uh, twin mattresses, full mattresses, queen mattresses, king mattresses, uh, adjustable so bases. Yeah. We just got this one in over here. Let me show you guys this one. Uh, it's a top split mattress. Whoa. Um, or, you know, like basically this is a king split where you get like yeah. to pick the mattresses out and the bases. Right, go up right. And down. But this is a top split for someone that doesn't want That's the king what, split. That's what we were talking about that. Mm -hmm. That's cool. So yes, we just got that in last week or two. So, yeah. Okay. All right, y'all. We went through a few options. We're going to show you which ones we uh, liked. So we like this one. <laughs> But then we came over here. All right, well. And oh, which other one? Oh, the one down here. So this is one option here. Okay. And then, because that's it's kind of like it builds up. That's the the lower price range. Mm-hmm. Then this is next. This is a pillow top here, I think. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. And this is a spring. So both of these mattresses are spring type. That's right. And our uh, mattress advisor was telling us that the coil types are better. And so we tested out these. Mm -hmm. This one with the pillow top, kind of like a little bit too soft for us. Right. You see, I kind of sat on it. You see, mm -hmm. I kind of molding to my, right. my yeah, body it already. Is. It and it was hard time. between those two. They felt about the same to me. Yeah. It was hard to kind of tell the difference. Yeah. But. It's hard until you lay on for a while. Mm -hmm. But I can definitely, I got to get up. Like, I, I have to push myself up. Yeah. Like this so I can feel myself. Because it has that pillow top. I don't know if y'all can see it or not. But it has, like, the mattress and then this little section here. And so, uh, the next option is here. So, from those two options, then we got here. And this one, I think this is a pillow top as well. Yeah. It, it is. It's, it's supposed to be cooling also. Cool. Cool. That's yeah. right. Yeah. Yeah. So this is a cooling pillow top mattress here, 
And uh, this one, you know, you can kind of feel how, how much more firmer it is, you know, with the coil and the pillow top and everything. But the next step up. You didn't skip it. Sapphire sleep. Sapphire sleep. And this one is a coil mattress. And what else? I want to say about this mattress. It's a, I think, a it's Euro a top, not a pillow Euro top, top that's but right. a Euro mm -hmm. top. Oh, yeah. And so it, it, it's a little bit, the Euro top is like a mix between the pillow top and what? I don't know. <laughs> it's, a mix. it's a mix between like a regular mattress and a pillow top. And so it's it's firm yet, but but it's soft at the same time. And uh, it's nice and nice and firm, and I think this is what we kind of leaned yeah, towards. Yeah, we right? wanted a really firm mattress for your back, so that was pretty much the most uh, firm one, but it was still soft mm -hmm. and yeah, had watch, some watch good qualities. Yeah, it didn't yeah. go anywhere. Mm -hmm. Like I can get up like this right here. Mm -hmm. You see? Yeah, and I have to like push yourself up. So that's what the Euro top does yeah. for you. Now let's go back over to the pillow top and see when I sit down, <laughs> just to see. Cause I, I felt the difference when we were recording when I sat down. <laughs> I'm not playing, like for real. You gotta do that little extra. I can get up. You sink down a it's little bit like more. Lean with it. Yeah. Cause I, I, I wanna like do like this to get up. Mm -hmm. It's kind of you sink down into it. And Megan likes to sleep in the middle of the bed. She okay, like, okay. She only have to stay All on right, the side. So we end up with like a a hollow point. I like wonder how that middle. happens with the dip in the middle. I think that has to do sleeps with in the middle. you in the middle of the bed. Really? Yeah so, yeah, so we decided to go with the Euro top bed over here. It's kind of a mix between the regular top and the pillow top. So it's soft but yet firm at the same time. So it won't give over time. And it also has a 10 year warranty. So if yeah, it does important. give anything, you know, we just bring it back in there and replace it. So we're getting loaded up now with our Euro top mattress. Awesome. And we bought a pillow as well. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we got our mattress, yay! And we're getting loaded up, so we'll just pick y'all up when we get back to the farm. So I got Tim pulling up with this trailer, and we are gonna get our mattress loaded. To everything that's moving, every single little thing. Kids playing hoops, going loop to loop. The rainbow colored bouncy balls and their ice cream scoops. Got my shoes in my hand and my feet in the sand. I got 20 ducklings in a row, like a little marching band. All right, y'all, we made it and we're getting things unloaded now. What? So, yes, we're at the end of this very long, fun, family, bed, shopping and buying day. Yay! It's terrible. No. Nah, I had fun. It's just, I, I don't see how people do this, like shopping for fun. This is not really fun, you know, it's just like a, like business. Gotta you know do it. To have beds at the end of the day. Yeah, and plus the air conditioning, the 
warehouse. The first warehouse yeah. didn't mm -hmm. have air conditioning, so it was hot in there. It was hot. <laughs> it was super hot. But we have it our beds, though. So it was like working or doing farm chores or something like that. Nah, but we're we're good. We're um, farm strong, so we toughed it out. And we, at the end of the day, we got our beds, and that's what matters. Now it's time to get them put together. Exactly, more fun. So we can we, we can't end the video without y'all seeing the beds like put together <sighs> inside yeah, of them. So yeah, yeah. We we'll pick y'all up. We might pick y'all up a little bit while we're putting them together, and uh, or we might just pick y'all up when they're when all they're done. done. So we'll see y'all in a minute once we get all of the material in the inside, mm -hmm. so we can actually start this process of putting everything yes. together. Most definitely. Chattanooga boy had a dollar and a dime Headed out for Nashville on the hard rock line I'm working on that old steamboat I learned to rob and steal When my feet had touched dry land How happy I did feel Saving every penny for to make up through the fall. Working for that dollar, but it never adds up at all. But coming around the river bank, heard the old train was so sane. The very next thing you hear from me, I've been tied to a ball and chain. And I don't know where I'll be But if it wasn't for that old sheriff I'd be back in Tennessee Playing cards and crap games Not looking for the score And if I ever get back home again I'll never own no Boys, listen to my song. May not know better, but I know you know right from wrong. Buy yourself a postcard so you can see the lights of town. Find yourself a country girl, keep quiet and sit old. What do y'all think? That's our bed. It looks good. Alright, get off of it. Fits perfect. What do you think, Mom? It's amazing. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna turn around so y'all can see it a little bit better. Alright, so this is the camera's just not doing it justice because I got a bag up. There you go. Yeah. So I can see the whole thing. Yeah. So we got the and we think that this is actually real wood because this is solid. It's uh this bed frame here, and uh it, it goes in perfect with the colors that it is because it kind of it's kind of white, but it's kind of like a washed, like right. stained looking white. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's actually like like that's a solid wood there. So we're excited about it. And we have a nice, nice, uh firm but soft mattress. And uh yeah, this is the best bed we've ever had. <laughs> what you think, Mom? Yes, most definitely. We, we, we've had king size beds before, but we've never had like a fancy a headboard, headboard like, like this. Oh, yeah, it was just on a frame, on a metal frame. <laughs> That's right. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we had to, uh, Megan had to make a run to Walmart probably uh, sometime tomorrow or something and get our covers and uh, what you call a little stretchy sheet to go on top. Yeah, fitted sheet. Fitted sheet and all that good stuff. And uh, we had to get nice pillows and, you know, all that good stuff and make it all fancy and nice. 
and I want to get a little bench to put at the end here so that we can sit on, you know, and just sit there and read the Bible and things in the morning, something like that. But uh, we're actually getting uh, our skirting installed tomorrow. Greg is going to install our skirting. He's going to be here early in the morning, and there are some, some things I need to go get, like the uh, pin nail anchors that go into the, the bottom plate and some screws, some self-tapping screws for the top. And so I actually have to head out. <laughs> you know, it's uh, dark outside. We've been rolling all day. But uh, I have to head out and go get some supplies from Home Depot before it closes. So I'll probably leave Megan and the boys here to start working on the bunk beds. Y'all think y'all can handle that? Yeah. Yes! Even if y'all get it unboxed. Then y'all might, might can get further than y'all think y'all can. So I think y'all can put it together. But I should be going along. Probably about 30 minutes to an hour. So uh, I think we're just going to pick y'all up tomorrow. And uh, we're not going to show you skirting on this video. <laughs> That'll be another video. But uh, we will show you all of the beds put together and everything, kind of walk y'all around the rooms because we know that y'all have been waiting a long time for this, yes, just like right. we have. And so we don't want to, you know, steal any of it from you all. We want to show it to all to you all. So we'll just pick up the camera uh, tomorrow or either later on tonight when we start putting the beds together and uh, just show y'all all the beds. We have two bunk beds to put together in the boys' room. We have our king size bed put together here. And uh, yeah, so we'll just pick y'all up uh, a little bit further along this process. All right, y'all, I've been back from Home Depot for a while. We've been in here for about two hours working on this bed. Megan and the boys almost had it all together. We had to take a couple parts apart and uh, put them back together. But I'm going to take y'all in here and show y'all the boys' bunk beds. All right, so let's see. Here we go. We got one of the boys' bunk beds up. And they got some nice, thick mattresses. Megan and I were talking about these mattresses, and we said, we we, we haven't. This is our, <laughs> those mattresses are too nice. This thick and this one. You know, nice. Good for real. We really got a good deal because they pretty much threw them in with the bed. So, you know, it's one really good price for everything. So, we're very happy. That's right. And uh, what y'all think, boys? Yeah. I'm, I'm going to let one, one of y'all go up to, uh, to the top bunk and see how the ladder feels. Go ahead, Tim. See if it's strong and sturdy. Oh, oh yeah. Not moving at all. What's it feel like up there? Good. I feel like I'm a good girl. Yep. All right. So we have one more of these bunk beds put together. And uh, we're going to have one over here. Mm -hmm. And then we're thinking about putting the other one right there. It's going to kind of restrict the door just a little bit. And so we're trying to figure it out. Because we could let it, let it, let's, let me back up a little bit so y'all can see the room. So y'all see where that one bunk bed is over there. And we still have room to go in the closet. And so we could possibly, we wanted to put it, put the other one here, lined up, going the same way and kind of have them facing each other. Uh, but we may have to uh, let it go the length like that. But I will see, because we may be able to do something with this door. We may, may take it down, who knows. We will figure something out, because I would like for them to be symmetrical. One on each side. Yep, so. And then that'll give them a lot of room to play. Mm hmm. In, in the, the middle. middle. Yeah. But we'll see. But it's a nice size room. Looks good. Mattresses. Bunk beds look good. Uh, it's about 12 o'clock now. And so we're about ready to shut it down for the night. And, and uh, we have Greg coming tomorrow to do skirting uh, early in the morning. So we got to rise real early. He might be here around 4 o'clock <laughs> for real. And so uh, I went to Home Depot and got those supplies. And I'm I, I'm going to save it to the next video to talk to y'all about Greg and those supplies. Got me running around Home Depot looking crazy. <laughs> and I was almost able to finish the bed, but I got the frame together. But Tim came and once again to the rescue. Yeah, she, me. she had a couple things backwards. Yeah, and, uh, we we fixed it up right. We so fixed it, so it was great. We, we're a team. That's right, boys. Y'all yeah, excited? Ready for bed? Yeah. Nice clothes on. That's right. Let me go home one more time and show y'all our bed. And uh, we got a yeah. Everybody, come on in here. We end the video in our room. Because uh, Megan is going to go tomorrow, right? And get sheets and all that good yes, stuff. Hopefully. Maybe you can find some good stuff at Walmart. Yeah, find something. And yeah, we're going to... Uh, we, we, we stopped and got dinner on the way. It was like an early dinner. We got it on the way back from getting the beds. So we might have a couple, couple of chocolate chip cookies before bed. <laughs> have a little snack and then go lay it down. But this is our bed here. Looks nice. Nice king size bed. And I can't wait to get, get all the covers and pillows and all that, that good good stuff on there. And uh, everything is coming together well. And so uh, we're going to go ahead and settle down for tonight so we can get ready to get up in the morning and start on skirting. 
But uh, we'll pick y'all up, like I said, on the next videos, and we'll kind of like take this process to the next level yes. with bed sheets and because we're like it's heck, we're starting to decorate. So that's, mm -hmm. that's uh, this is like the first decorative type thing that's that we're gonna right. be doing. Yeah, so, so it's coming together, and our uh, cabinets should be here next week, right? September second, somewhere mm -hmm. around there. So we got about a week and a half or so. Maybe so. We're, we're yeah. eking up on the end of the month, yeah. but we're not quite there yet. So we got cabinets gonna be installed in about a week yeah. or so. Well, they're gonna be delivered, and then they're gonna, we're yeah, gonna set, we up a, to set up an installation date. date. But yeah. you know what though? I ordered the sink, so yep, when got the sink. cabinets mm -hmm. arrive, they'll be able to set the sink, you know, basin around, you know, form the cabinets around the sink and everything. So and sink. once we get done, once Greg gets done with the skirting, then I'm gonna get flooring, and we're gonna go ahead and do all of our hardwood floors throughout all the. Mm -hmm. uh, the vinyl plank flooring so everything's coming together is, is what we're trying to say and uh we're we're excited about it and uh but we're tired tonight so we're gonna go ahead and end today's video here is IAG Farms it's IAG Farms we'll see y'all on the next one we got beds when I first got saved I was in prison when I first came to the Lord and when I first got saved there was a preacher that came by and I was trying to ask him like how do you learn all these Bible scriptures and everything and he said when I first got saved what I did was I made flashcards and he said I would quiz myself on those flashcards every day. And that's what I did. Yeah. Yeah, I had flashcards and I would like, I had the, you know, the numbers, like right, verse on the right. front I'll and the scripture on the back. And I would put it up and quote it to myself that's and then flip exactly, it over and see. That's yeah. how things uh -huh. So that's how I learned scripture. Start off mm -hmm. like learning like two a day or something. Yeah. And then kind of work out. You got to review 300 every day. Mm -hmm. yeah. And this year that's it'll be on the book of Acts. So it'll be a lot of, which all of them are good. good yeah, it's awesome. Yeah, and I have to tell you a testimony about that because. I was actually, I was at a prison called Walnut Grove yes, sir. Like when I, I was at Rankin County, actually. And uh, I had just got saved, just started, you know, I had got out the games and stopped doing drugs and all those types of things, and started getting my life together and everything, started learning about the Lord. And it was easy to do at Rankin County, you know, because it was like a, you know, a less hostile facility. Right. But I had what they call like a lot of points, you know, like doing stupid stuff in prison before I got saved. And so they were taking me to parchment. So I got on the bus going to parchment, and I had just got out of the games. I'm talking about like a week before that. And the Lord, he spoke to me and he said, get rid of everything in your life that's keeping you from serving me. Mm -hmm. And I knew that that was the first thing I needed to do was get out the game. So I got out the game, you know, and did that. Next week, I'm here at the park. And so I'm, I'm on the bus, and it, it took a while for us to get there because they had to stop at different places. And it's like, I, I, I could just just hear, like, say, speaking to me, saying, like, you got to pick the picky gang up today, you back right. up, do this, do that. For your they, 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 they exactly, for your safety. Yeah. They're going to beat you up and all this and all that. But I kept on with those scriptures that I had learned about because I didn't have a Bible because we were handcuffed. Right. I, I couldn't, like, right. get through Bible Maybe pages. Have one, yeah. Exactly. But I had it in my heart because of those flashcards, you know, because of quizzing myself. Mm -hmm. I just kept on saying those scriptures over and over. Every time, like, Satan would throw an accusation or try to get me to be afraid. I would say those scriptures like over and over and over and over and over. And it's like when I got to parchment, because I was so scared about Satan was trying to tell me, they're going to beat you up. You got to get in from the and all this about it. New exactly right. But well, when, when we pulled up the parchment, they called my name. And they said, Timothy Sales. Yeah, so I stood up, ready to get off the bus. And then the, the bus driver went over there and whispered something to the, uh, the guard from parchment. And they said, sit back down. So I sit back down. And after about 30 minutes, I can see him on the outside of the bus talking. After about 30 minutes, they crunked the bus up and drove me and took me back to Rankin County. So it was just, Jesus, it was just yeah. a test. And <laughs> yep. it makes you wonder if you had a, your mm -hmm. mind started going elsewhere. Yeah, mm -hmm. it was a test. That's right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. Yeah, so, so learn those mm -hmm. differences.